Man. Okay, Paris. What's up? How are you? Good to have you here. Pleasure to be here. Oh shit, it looks just like all the other ones too. Yeah, it looks silly. <laughs> Interesting. Should I try it? Try it. I didn't even warm up. But let's see. Yeah, don't go full force. Don't go I full force? Yeah, I can give you a lighter one if you want to warm up. Let me just feel it so I know really you won't do it. <laughs> <laughs> Let me see, your, is that the four you need to do? This is the four. I can't do the four. How far can you get? Nothing. Not even... <sighs> that was not bad though. Okay, maybe I should take the bet off. <laughs> <laughs> right, two and a half? And I can hold here? Yeah, technically the rule is it has to, you can't do what I just did. It has to be upward, yeah. So I have to be here. Yeah, you can have one arm to help you set it. Okay. And then like, you can even have it set it like that, and then you can go. Yeah. Okay. It's number three. This is it three? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's a hard, uh, hard warm up. This is a two. I'll do a two. Okay. This is a two and a half. You took the. Uh, oh, I, okay. I must have picked the. You can warm up with the two is better. Yeah. Because even the two is not as. Okay. Two and a half. Yeah. How was this? Tough. Okay. <laughs> take, take a breather. Take a breather. Yeah. Yeah. This is a three. So basically, I love doing bets in this gym. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why, but it gives me a kick. So you okay? shouldn't bring you to Las Vegas. <laughs> never, never. Take, never take me to Vegas. <laughs> but actually, you know what? Maybe you take me to Vegas because I only make bets where the odds are in my favor. In okay. Vegas. Those are not in my favor. So this is a gripper number four. And the bet is, is if Larry can close this gripper, he owns Spartan Fitness. It's as simple as that. Okay. Let's show them the number four because we're going to have the disbelievers. Exactly. People are not going to believe that's a number Just four. Just a handful of people in the world can close it. Really. Okay. Eddie Hall gave it a shot when he was here, by the way. Huh? How close did he get? Any close? Not really close. So. Not close I'm at sorry, all. sorry, Eddie. <laughs> <laughs> all right. So what I'm going to do is a number three. All right. So would you mind taping it here? Sure. Thanks. All right. First, I'll go here. All right. Ah, oh, shit. Getting even close to number three. So close, close, <laughs> close. <laughs> close. So can you imagine? It's a valiant effort. <laughs> yeah, it was about a... Yeah. Yeah. I don't think anybody off just out of nowhere just can come and close a three or a four. You know, you need to actually train for such a thing. That's for sure. Right. Yeah. So I'll train for the number four and come, come back, back take the gym. You have one, you have you have six months. Because <laughs> I know you, if you train for it, you close it. So I have to be careful. Okay. Solid. <laughs> All right. First thing I notice when I walk in are two things: cardio and more cardio. <laughs> things things you love <laughs> <laughs> yeah my kryptonite so exactly. this is a ladder mill exactly so it moves on a belt and you keep going and you can adjust the speed you want to give it a go uh not really honestly <laughs> <laughs> would you like to demonstrate yeah, sure 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 <laughs> I'll, I'll just put it on a low speed and this is just a low speed and then if i go faster it's just like this and okay. you can even adjust the angle here as well. The angle? Yeah, exactly. Okay. So you can make it more difficult. But to be completely vertical. Exactly, exactly. So you're not using your legs, you're using your arms completely. Okay, that's awesome. I love so, that. So now we're going to show you the gym a bit. So basically, we take organization here very, very seriously. You're going to see all the back and bicep machines are in this station. A lot of gyms, you know, they throw one machine there, one machine here. But for us, everything needs to be perfectly organized. Okay. Over here, this is the, the leg station. So you can see many different leg presses from Elite FTS to Atlantis to Life Fitness. This is from Watson Gym. Really, every angle you can think of. Awesome. But you don't like doing machines much anyway, right? Uh, there's a time and a place for it. So when I'm doing bodybuilding, yeah. Machines are everything. And machines are everything. For sure. Okay, okay. And this is more your territory. So here is more weightlifting or powerlifting stuff. We have two platforms, calibrated plates, 
calibrated weightlifting plates as well, which are those. Okay. Sahali. Two cages and half a rack. Love the half rack. <laughs> <laughs> and this is where the CrossFitters are, you know, they kept coming to our side, <laughs> so I had to buy their own rig so they'd stop bothering us, basically. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right. So with the gym, we decided as well to incorporate some MMA. So we have a cage and a boxing ring. So we get a lot of uh, fighters from uh, an organization called Brave. And uh, I mean, listen, they love training here. They make an, a good show for us. Do you ever host any events here, any fights? Yeah, honestly, we have hosted like gym versus gym, okay. things like this, yeah. So it gets more uh, exciting. Uh, this tire is a joke for you, probably, so we should not talk about it. <laughs> <laughs> That's the joke? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. The grip looks like it'd be tough, though. It looks very smooth and worn out. That's true. That's true. Yeah, guitar. Here we have an icon over here. All right. People love taking pictures of him. <laughs> awesome. Yeah, yeah. And then just like the movies, we have the kicking bag that swivel. Exactly. So this one, you lock it in place, and then some bags, we, we let them sway. So this can sway. So, and then you can just lock it in its place. So this is called the banana bag. So you can do a low kick as well. Because a boxing bag, you can't really do any low kicks. This is a custom-made boxing ring as well. So there's many different ring sizes. We base this size on the McGregor versus Mayweather boxing ring size. Okay. Just so it can be a good uh, memory. <laughs> awesome. Nice. Over here, we just have some, as well, ab machines and everything. While personally, I don't like that many machines, um, the reason why I do it is because I try to cater to not just the things that I like, but the thing that the mass people like. Right. You know, so it's... 100%. Yeah. I, I love free weights, dumbbells, things like this. Same here. Yeah. <laughs> Over here, we have three different kinds of dumbbells. We have those uh, hex dumbbells, regular circular dumbbells, and then a Thompson bell, which means your hand goes inside the dumbbell. Okay. Hey. It's great pretty to see different. a gym that has all three. <laughs> yeah. And this is a 203 pound kettlebell as well. I don't know what's the purpose of it with a kettlebell <laughs> this heavy, but... Yeah, I've never seen... It's like a cannonball more than a kettlebell. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. <laughs> you take down a ship with that. <laughs> and over here we have uh, Larry's private room, which is known as the, the monster room. <laughs> okay. So uh, I, I'm sure you can see yourself on TV as well. Oh, that's awesome. <laughs> which we use as motivation. <laughs> so the thing is, is that we got dumbbells up to 220. And today you're going to try 232. And I already made a word to, to my people. I said, if anybody can lift the 220, I'm going to get heavier. And heavier until there's a weight that nobody can lift. So if you're successful today, I'm going to get a 240 pound dumbbell. So then you're okay. going to have to come back and challenge us again. So that's how they keep me coming back. That's how they okay. keep you coming back. <laughs> Until 300. After 300, no company is willing to manufacture something more than 300. So. Nor is there a human, I think, in the world that can press a 300 pound dumbbell. <laughs> Good. <laughs> not yet, anyways. Not yet. Not you yet. haven't seen my offspring. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. And then behind you, you have a competition um, bench press rack, which, I mean, you get the people to be able to stand over here so they can spot you easier. And then that I'm sure you know is a, a monorack. My favorite kind too. Your favorite kind. Yeah, very thing nice. is that we use it in the last powerlifting meet, but the issue was people are so used to taking two steps back that it kind of, I mean, threw, threw, threw their groove off. Yeah. So you need to even train, I think, to just squat in your place, right? 100%, yeah, it's definitely a big difference. Yeah. Yeah. We have a monster belt there as well. All right. I, think, I think you guys had a challenge, right, in Iceland, if you can pick it up with one arm. That's right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, if you pick it up with one arm, you get a free t-shirt. Oh, free t-shirt, okay. Maybe I should go get my free t-shirt. <laughs> <laughs> right. Oh, what do we have here? Ah, oh, yes. So these are the adjustable dumbbells that we'll be using so Larry can do his 232 pounds because, unfortunately, we only have up to 220. You know, we were not expecting someone like Larry to be born to this world. So, <laughs> so but, but because he's born, so we have these adjustable dumbbells and he's gonna attempt the 232 pounds. All right, I'm pumped. Incline as well, not flat, actually. I forgot to mention that. That's right, incline. <laughs> incline. 
So over here we just have a bunch of shoulder exercises as well, Viking press, seated barbell press, more, more machines, more things that you don't really do. <laughs> this thing as well is for like uh, your grip as well, where you just do this. So we have so many grip challenges and things like this. So. This is a different kind of sled. It's called a bear crawl. Basically, you push when you're like this. Ah, oh, this could be good to make the truck pull. Oh, exactly, because yeah, it yeah, gets yeah. you. Because with a sled, you're using a lot of upper body strength as well to push it. But this removes it. It's really just mainly legs. Yeah, I've never seen this before. Yeah, this yeah. would be great to mimic a truck pull. Exactly. For sure. A yoke. This is obviously the most crowded area because it's the chest station. <laughs> so most, most people like to do the chest. <laughs> What do you think of this machine, though? I mean, I've been told that it's not really safe on the shoulders and everything. Do you do incline flies? I do. You do, okay. I just don't go heavy. Don't I go, go very heavy. light. Very I go light. for a pump, high reps. Okay. Because I get a pump, but it's always a worry that you might stretch way too much and hurt yourself. Well, for me, I go as deep as my shoulders let me. But it's... So where it gets dangerous is when you go too heavy and too fast. Too fast, okay. So I like to go light. Like at the most I'll use maybe 60 pound dumbbells each hand. I'll go to my end range, most, okay. but right. it'll be very slowly. And I slow down, especially once I start approaching the end range, right? So injuries happen when, with explosive movements. Explosive movements, okay. Yeah, so you're, you're coming down with, even if it's moderately heavy weight, right? and then you're really just explosively hitting that end range, okay. then you're much more susceptible to an injury. Okay. So for any lift, squat, pinch, delt, even a pec fly, just everything slow. should be slow and under control. And that's why I think I saw you when you squat, you go gradually, you don't try to get a bounce underneath. You really go slowly, 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 slowly. Exactly. And, mm. and on the eccentric, on the lowering phase of the movement, you're gonna be you're stronger than the concentric. You can always handle more weight on the way down than up. True. So it's okay to go slow. You're not going to be, it's not going to make it harder when you're coming back up. Okay, that's good to know. Yeah. And over here we have a uh, rock climbing wall that's on a conveyor belt as well. So do you want to give it a go or? This is even harder than the ladder mill. <laughs> yeah. You can All give right. it a go if you want. All right. <laughs> I'm tempted, but sure. Let's see. Let's see what you can do. Huh. Okay, go. Oh, shit. <laughs> I gave it a go. <laughs> <laughs> I think you just freaked out. That's what happened. <laughs> I can lower the speed further. Look, I'll put it okay. this. Okay, baby steps here. You got it, you got it. Easy. Come on. Nice. You ready? You ready for the next speed? Definitely not. <laughs> <laughs> Just a bit more. Okay. Come on, come on. Keep going. Here we have a 40 degree, 40 degrees hot tub, and over here we have an 8 degree cold um, ice bath. So for us, I think we reached a point where even 8 degrees is not cold enough, so we're going to get something over here that's 4 degrees as well. Okay, that and definitely. I, it does improve your recovery, right? Because I saw you do a thing with Thor like 4 days a week. Every workout. Every workout, exactly. Yeah, 100% yeah, includes recovery. It's nothing more powerful on earth for anti-inflammation than a hot and cold tub. Sure. Okay, okay. And you do the sauna as well, or? Uh, uh, sauna, no. Okay. I don't. I don't do sauna or steam room. Okay. But I've had huge difference with hot and cold for anti-inflammatory. Have you tried the cryo? Because I think the cryo is bullshit. I think it's a waste of time and money. Exactly. Because yeah. it's very dry. It doesn't really stick to your skin. And when things are wet. It's like spotted, like on your back and shoulder, wherever the air is blowing. Yeah, yeah. It's yeah. not really like immersive like the cold tub. I agree. I completely yeah. agree. <laughs> 
ما يبي هو الحين والله سالته سي هي كيف فور يو سو بيسكلي ذس جاي وانتس تو ارم رسل لاري ويلز هي از ذا بيست جاي ان اور كونتري ان ارم رسلينج بت اي مين لاري وود بت هي جست ارم رسل سم ون اند ناو هي نيدز تو ريست انفورشنتلي اي كان نوت بي بيرسويدد مان يو غوت تو ستي اندفيد ذا اونلي تراي ويل بلاي افتر واتس ذات يو كان اونلي تراي افتر ويل بلاي After we play? Yeah, no, only check. Check? Only crying. Oh, well, it's your fault, guy. No, that's how he persuades me to do it for real, though. Yeah, he's dirty. He's a dirty guy. He's a dirty guy. Actually, the other guy got hurt a little bit. Yeah. And now I think it's. Huh? This is a week for me. Chuff. You come back to Bahrain, then I'll call you. Train, train harder. Only train now. No, train here. <laughs> you born 95, right? 94. 94. Yeah. Ah, you one year bigger than me. You 95? Yeah, I'm 95. Okay. Yeah, he looks younger small. than me. Can you I'm believe younger it? than you. I'm younger than you. That's unbelievable. <laughs> Come to me. I can't. I'm sorry. I cannot. Lift up. <laughs> what's, what's up with this? So the table is built for only right arm. He built okay, the table. You can only. <laughs> not really one. You can only try. But it's a real one. No, yeah, yeah. Bo, bo, hello. Next time, next time, like next time we will. Next time we will. Next time, next time. I'll be in Bahrain very okay. soon. He'll be, I he'll promise. Be, 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 be. I'll be ready for you. <laughs> I am. I don't want to get hurt. And you're undefeated. No, no. <laughs> you're gonna stay that way. Trust me. It's all right. Yeah. Just try. Hello, hello, hello. Hello. You know, I've been on a real good on. note here. No injuries. No so. injuries. One moment. لا 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 يلا 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 بقى بروح فوق بروح فوق All right so over here we have a cafe as well for healthy food and healthy shakes and everything like that and it's actually outsourced and the reason why we outsourced why we could have done it in house we don't believe that you can do everything sometimes working with other people that are specialized in something we have a stronger team I think the day you say that I can do everything in the world is the day you you fail So we're getting, even like our cleaning, the cleaning in the, in the gym is outsourced. Wherever we can outsource, we outsource. So you can always have the best of the best at your gym. You agree? That's right. 100%. Perfect. That's right. So over here, you can actually see the entire gym as a viewpoint. You know, so you see that uh, we even have calisthenics bars for people into calisthenics. Whatever your sport is, you can find uh, your calling over here. And I mean, the idea is more, So our country is very known for bodybuilding athletes, but what, what the purpose of this gym is, is to try to breed athletes in, in this part of the region. So now we're doing a lot of strongman stuff, car pulling, car deadlift, and all these kind of stuff. So, uh, I mean, this is one of the reasons why we invited you, because you're one of the strongest guys in the world. So it's, uh, it's an honor to have you here. It's an honor to be here. Thank you. Thanks Thank for you. having me. Thank you. Slips. 
good? Yeah. Yeah, it's good. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay, that's good. What did? Yeah. Easy work! Cracks or pops on you? Are you sure? <laughs> you are old, it's okay. Stay with that. Pleasure, pleasure. Can you stand up? Ice? Is it ice? It's okay. I'm fine. Manufacture the car deadlift bar here, okay. so you can lift your car. Okay. If you can lift this car, I guarantee you, you will drive away with it today. Okay. 
It's a deal? Perfect. Oh, deal. Yeah. What it's, kind a, of, it's on a video. Did you get more motivating than that? <laughs> drive away with a 4x4. Four four. Drive away with a 4x4 four four <laughs> by just lifting it. You lift it, you drive it. <laughs> Are you up for the challenge? I'm up for it, for sure. Okay, let's see. Let's for see. sure. I might as well get my belt. You might as well get the PR belt. <laughs> Oh, straps are not part of the deal. Well, okay. Well, I can do no straps. Yeah, no straps. No straps. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. Go, Larry. Let's go. How are? Come on, come on. Think about the call. <laughs> <laughs> you want it or no? You go first. Here? Is, yeah, you're really big. Okay. So you're gonna have to go as much as you can on the right. On the right. Yeah, exactly. Mm. Okay. Now you go here. Just grip it the way you do. Okay. Oh, like this. Yeah, exactly. Uh, if I come okay. In, hold on. You say go. One second. Okay. Ready? Yep. Go. Let's go! <laughs> I think four men. Four. four. The bar needs to be longer. Yeah. yeah. It just didn't, I didn't feel it move at all. No, I knew it would move. That's why I made the bet. <laughs> I know.